listen. Well, I didn't think this was going to be my first ever TikTok post, but I just want to put this information out there. I am a licensed ship captain. I have a 200 ton license with a towing endorsement. I have personally spent 16 years on the water working. Any other captain, tankerman, deckhand, mate, any of them can verify what I'm saying. Ask any of them. And I don't know where you're at. I haven't seen a single video, but anybody else that works on the water. <clears throat> I had, so one barge, one barge of oil is 198 feet long by 35 feet wide and 35 feet to 40 feet deep. Okay. There's half a million gallons of oil in a single inland barge. Okay. You don't, the process to pump fuel off of that barge is so strict that even if a teaspoon of that oil or that fuel spills into the water or out of the hose, the Coast Guard is called and there's a huge report and an incident made. Does that happen? Sometimes, is there a tanker man that's taken off the freaking fuel line and he didn't blow it out good enough? blow it out means you run air through it to flush out all the liquid before you disconnect the, the freaking line. <clears throat> but sometimes there's like a drop, literally an eyedropper drop of, we're talking this much fuel hits the water. And yes, sometimes, most of the time, that's just left alone. Because why would you make an incident out of that? You don't accidentally mix diesel and and gasoline and then deliver it to gas stations all over the country. I'm sure I worked on in the maritime industry. I guarantee that on land with these truckers and these tanker drivers and these guys working on the interstates, their process is just as strict as ours. Guarantee. You don't just, oh, oh, I spill. And then, then the amount, let's think about the amount of fuel. The amount of gasoline and diesel that would have to be mixed together would be millions. I mean, millions of, one barge holds a half million gallons. It's 500,000 gallons. Just one barge. We used to push two, three, four at a time from I used to work on a boat that we pushed uh, fuel from Lake Charles, Louisiana to Houston, Galveston, um, Corpus Christi, places like that. To all the refineries and all the refineries down in Louisiana. You would have to... Oh, I accidentally mixed 20 barges of fuels together. The, the amount is unreal. It's, it's not even realistic that you would just accidentally, human error, mix diesel fuel and gasoline together. I just need you all to know that. If you need me to verify my credentials, I absolutely will. I know what the hell I'm talking about. It's not an accident. 